Hey everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel and today I played as Chang Ah and I've played her before and I really like her character and her kit and everything she can do. Without further ado, let's get right into this video. So basically in this match I was playing against Asilla which is another mage that I'm interested in learning how to play. I just recently got her and she, you know, defeated the minions before me therefore she got level 2 before me but luckily I was able to barely survive, but if I was her, I would have definitely chased. But the reason she probably didn't chase is because, you know, the assassins are now rotating to mid lane. And it wouldn't be a very good idea because she would probably have died trying to get me. And I was just level 1, so it really wasn't that worth. And at this point, we're just, you know, both waiting to see who's gonna poke first but I skipped those two minutes because nothing really happened that big but Scylla got really damaged by me and I went to go get my red buff because Thanatos had dropped it for me so she's just sitting under her tower I guess trying to heal up a little bit but I think Changa is like really really good she's one of the probably the best mages there is even though she doesn't have a jump, her X makes her immune to damage. So she can basically get out of most people's like super damaged abilities, like their ults, of course. And of course, Scylla's X. I think that's her X. But like, I'm a good counter against Scylla because she can root. She can no longer root me if I use my X wisely, to be honest. So right here I thought I could get Scylla, but I didn't do nearly enough damage. But I almost died from tick damage from Basket. She really hit me a lot. And back to what I was saying, but I'm going to let you guys watch this clip. Like, Thanatos got Scylla, she used her ult, but too bad she couldn't juke. And another thing I like about Chang Ah is she can block one of the tower shots with her X. So technically she can really dive the tower better than any other mage that I can think of to be honest because she can block that one tower shot it actually even though it's one it actually can be really really helpful when you're trying to get a kill on someone who's low health and she can heal herself and she does quite a bit of damage it's just she definitely has to be like top tier mid lane in my opinion it, look I just Gosh, all that damage. If I didn't, if I was not Chung Ah, I would have got hit by that. And I understand some people might um, compare her to other healers, like maybe Aphrodite. I think personally, I think she's better than Aphrodite. And the reason why, not in the healing department per se, I think Aphrodite might have her beat, obviously depending on the build you use. But just the kit of being efficient enough to survive. without being super vulnerable because with Aphrodite right there she got absolutely melted that's so sad but it happened poor Scylla I kind of felt bad for her and but back to what I was saying Aphrodite she has her ult which makes her immune but with Chang Ah she doesn't even have to use her ult to get out of um, a sticky situation although with Aphrodite she can save a whole other person's life I feel like there's a lot of situations you can't get out of if you're not Chang'a. Because you're only on a 10 second cooldown with Chang'a, with Aphrodite is like a, it's an ult, so it's going to be down for at least 40 seconds. Probably more depending on the build you use. Right here, I wouldn't be able to do this if I wasn't anyone else. But unfortunately, I don't think there was a call out that they were missing in right lane, but it wouldn't have mattered anyways unfortunate I think they got both of us right there so and right here if I would have hit my ult on basket directly I would have killed her right there she would have survived that I should have focused Cupid right here but I was like let me def defend us from the enemy mid laner is what I always think most of the time and I wasted my X for some reason I don't want to talk about it I couldn't hit my autos right here it was just a tragic situation and instead of retreating I tried to be greedy and hit 
And you can hear me spamming my abilities so we can hear that, but it was too late. I should have used my circle and then used my X. I would have lived a little longer and Basket might have backed off. But luckily, Chernabog was able to clean that up for us and it didn't really matter. Like, I've seen people absolutely wreck with Chang'e. Ah, it's just because she has a great ability kit, in my opinion. And yes, I missed my ult right there. I thought it'd go far enough to, you know, hit Basket, but unfortunately it did not. And I wasted my ult, which is on cooldown now. With Soul Gem, it just... I feel like her healing goes to another level because Soul Gem procs ever so often. I believe it's when you take damage or how much damage you do. Yeah, it stacks. I see the stack going up right now. And right here, I'm dodging so much damage. Of course, Basket hit me with her X or something. But we're able to get a double kill. Um, Scylla wasted her ult. I was thinking that we could get Capri right here, but unfortunately, I didn't realize that Cupid was there. That was a misplay on my behalf. But also, Yamoja ran away and she was like half health and a tank. I guess we're not going to talk about that, but um, she could have been helping, probably body blocking and healing right there, but unfortunate. I was able to use my ult on Scylla and delete her, and now we're going to have this 2v, what, like 2v3 fight? 2v4 because Arthur's going to gank right here. Then Toast gets off his ult, and now Sean Wukong is running for his life. And right here again. I'm, I'm coming for blood. I'm just going for it because I'm trying uh, and I can heal and I can dodge a tower shot. Then I let the tank slash warrior, you know, take the rest of the damage. Emoji gets a wonderful stun right there and I'm able to chase Basket and get her with my square. And then King Arthur takes the shots for me and we're able to get that middle tower. Now we're ganking right lane. And yeah, we're basically, there's no way they're going to survive this. But it's funny right here, I thought my team was going to go ahead and kill them. Kill him, Cupid. So I wasn't really shooting because I didn't want to take a kill. Although, now that I think about it, I did most of the damage to Cupid. I took about half his health right there. So I don't know why, what I was thinking in the moment. But at the moment I was thinking, okay, let me not steal someone's kill. I don't know why. I should just go for it. You know, it's team effort at the end of the day. So that was great, a great play by Emoja. She skyrocketed me forward and I was able to use my ult on Scylla right there. And I didn't realize until after I watched this that Shernbot got attacked by Basket because he was in the back by himself. Which is what assassins are supposed to do. They're supposed to pick off people. Because they're not really going to survive if they're jumping in the whole entire team and fighting like that. I wasn't going to um, dive this phoenix because I didn't know how long I would be diving it and so I waited till the other people did it instead of me and so I guess he wasted his circle because he wasn't even running he was just he was just taking it taking all that damage poor guy and then Cupid didn't know what hit him he ran into the wall and everything <laughs> with his dash and oh the build the build the build my bad sorry the build was soul gem shoes of focus chronos pendant divine ruin um sense of time and i prob i think i was going to try to experiment with obsidian shard because i don't really use that often and i most most of the time i use basically almost the same mage build and I'm, it's kind of getting boring so i need to mix it up a little bit but yeah, this is how the game ended, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, everyone.